How to connect Namecheap domain to Shopify. My name is Kraus and in today's tutorial I'm going to show you how to actually add your domain from Namecheap onto Shopify. Now to get started you do want to both open up the Shopify dashboard and then also the general Namecheap dashboard. Then once you are right here make sure to select the domain that you want to add to Shopify and then click on manage. Now by the way guys I currently give out my Shopify course for completely free so if you do want to streamline your or Shopify journey, make sure to click on the link down below. Either way, once you've opened this dashboard right here, we will have to head over to Shopify and then open up the settings on the bottom left and head over to domains right here. Now, uh, I assume on your end this is going to be slightly different. Uh, probably you are only going to have this default myshopify.com domain, but either way the setup is going to be exactly the same. Then just click on connect existing domain right here and then we will have to head back to Namecheap and make sure to click on advanced DNS right right here, uh, which will then open up the DNS settings for your domain. Right here, make sure to delete all of the um, records that you have added, make sure to delete all of them, otherwise this isn't going to work properly. And then we will have to add three new records onto this. Now I will also leave you this in the description down below. First of all we will have to add a new A record, as for the host value this is going to be an add. Then as for the IP address, we will just simply have to copy this from right here onto this. Then as for the TTL, just make sure to leave this at automatic um, so that you don't mess around with anything. Then as for the AAAA record, once again the host value is going to be an add. And as for the IPv6 address, we are just going to once again copy this from, in the, from the description down below. Just click on save. And then as for the CNAME record, now this is really important, right here under host we will have to put in www and under the target value we will have to put in shops.myshopify.com. Now make sure that you will actually leave in this dot at the end because otherwise this isn't going to work. Then just click on save and now make sure to actually copy the domain from Namecheap. So just copy this domain, head over to Shopify and paste in that existing domain. However, make sure to don't forget that you will have to add an www in front. So in this case this would be www.crowdsecompany.online. Then I'm going to click on next right here. And now basically you will just have to click on verify connection. This is then going to take a couple of seconds and now this successfully got added. Now if I'm now going to click on krausecompany.online, this is really important, we aren't done yet. We will actually have to change the domain type to primary so that this is actually also being displayed in the address bar when people are visiting our online store. So I'm just going to change the domain type right here and I'm going to repeat the uh, whole process for the www one. So I'm just going to change this to primary as well and now we successfully have set up our website and if we're now going to view this, this is going to be correctly set up. We all know that starting a successful Shopify store can be super hard. That's why I'm right now giving out my Shopify course for completely free. Now you're going to learn everything needed to actually streamline your Shopify success in that exact course. So make sure to click on the link down below to get started.